You're not still mad? For what? You didn't do anything wrong. Ethan, it was all my fault for overreacting. Sheridan made me see that. You talked to Sheridan? Yes, yeah, she was great. She made me realize that there's nothing going on between you and Teresa. There never could be. That's what I've been trying to tell you. <laughs> I love you, and I know you love me. I'm sorry you were so upset. And it was all just a series of dumb little things. Seeing you with Teresa at the ballet, walking in on you, holding her after she fell, and you just accidentally calling me Teresa. Can you ever still love me after being such a jealous schoolgirl? <laughs> of course. I mean, Ethan, I realize now that all these incidents that happened with Teresa, it, it all started because you were just trying to protect her from her older brother. Yeah, I told you that. I mean, he has a real thing for the cranes. I mean, she would have been in a lot of hot water. I know, and so while you were being a real knight in shining armor trying to protect the housekeeper's daughter, instead of telling you how proud I was of you, I acted like a shrew. Don't be so hard on yourself, Gwen. I mean, I don't think I've handled everything very well myself. Yes, you did. You are the nicest, kindest, most wonderful man I have ever met. And I'm gonna love you for the rest of my life, Ethan Crane. And I love you. I'm gonna take the shortcut across the course to my house. Let me at the dance, Reese. Hi. Right. Till then, amigo. <laughs> <laughs> Teresa? Teresa? Is Teresa here? 